Hey everyone, how's it going today? So, today we're going to look at the latest version that just got released for SRB Minor, version 239. I didn't do anything for 238 because as you see right here, there was a big bug that was introduced in version 238 and probably why HiveOS didn't even put an update for it. They're stuck on 237, which worked. Uh, fix and valid share issue on algorithm Dynex. Now, 238 was initially, or at least originally pushed out because something in his code was causing issues with the proof of useful work solutions on Dynex, and 238 was supposed to fix that, which it did, but it introduced another bug that was causing a lot of issues. So 239 is the bug fix plus the proof of useful work fix. Everything should be perfectly good now. Uh, he also says performance improvement on Dynex for some GPUs. Uh, here's the big thing. <laughs> Reduced dev fee for algorithm Dynex down to 2%. We appreciate it, Dr. 83. That's the dev right here, Dr. 83. He dropped it down to 2%. Thank you from all miners to you. Um, I'm not sure about this JSON API. It's beyond me. And then other minor bug fixes, probably for other algorithms or something like that. Uh, the main focus of 239 is to get uh, everything perfectly stable and happy on Dynex. So, since HiveOS is still currently stuck at the time of recording this on 237, let's scroll down here and we're going to grab this HiveOS update script from 237 to 239. Let's grab this, copy it. Now, let's shoot on over to my Octo One, which is a 12 GPU 6600 XT rig. And you can see we are currently running version 237. Simple, easiest way to upgrade. Go to run command, control V, copy that whole line in there, and just hit run. It's going to work on it. Give it about four or five minutes or so. It needs to stop 237, download 239, copy it into 237's folder, and then start up the miner. And then the miner takes a minute or two for it to kick in. So I'll be back once it's stable. Okay, so we've been up almost five minutes. It's running version 239, and our hash rate is just shy of 39 kilohash. Before, we were running just shy of 41 kilohash, so we lost 2 kilohash on the whole rig. Not a big deal, really. 2 kilohash. I'll gladly sacrifice 2 kilohash for the program working correctly in the proof of use for work in Dynex and making it more stable. No problem. So, with that being done, let's switch over to Octo 3 which is my 30 series rig that mines Dynex. And we can see here, running version 237, getting 40 kilohash on this rig. And this is 23070 Ti's and 6370s. So same deal, come up here and it remembers the latest command here. Just click that and run. And we'll be back in about five minutes again. Okay, now for the Nvidia side, we are now running version 239. We got 10 accepted shares and we are at 38.88 kill hash, basically 39. Um, we're 40, 40, 40 and a half before. So what's that, 39? We basically lost two kill hash here on this rig as well. Again, not a big deal. If it helps the proof of useful work and the stability for Dynex, I'm all for it. I'll definitely gladly sacrifice two kilohash per rig because guess what it's not really i'm losing two kilohash because everyone else loses two kilohash so it's still par for the course as long as the network's stable and it works even better it attracts more investors i'm happy for it also power usage does not seem to be affected whatsoever it's not better it's not worse in this version basically just a bug fix now, I probably should have said this at the beginning of the video, but if you're actually still paying attention, thank you. Uh, if you're wondering why, maybe in about a week or so, your version 237 doesn't work anymore, 237 will be getting deprecated and not allowed to mine on the Dynex network probably in the next week or so at the time of releasing this video. If I don't have an exact date, you probably should go and check either the Discords for SRB Miner or more importantly, the Dynex Discord. I will leave a link for both of them in the video description below. So that's basically all I have for this video. Uh, it's basically par for the course. It's a regular update for SRB Miner. No hash rate gains, a, a very slight drop, if anything. Not a big deal, but it's mostly a bug fix to improve the stability of proof of useful work on Dynex. 
and it is mandatory. So that being said, thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next video.